Hey, it's Ms. Alana here working on math, getting smarter and smarter every day. And I know you are too. We are working on bus driver math. This is day four, question number four. Let's begin. So let's start by reading the question. Read it with me. It says, we traveled a distance of 19 miles. Convert this distance into feet. Here's your conversion factor. It says one mile equals 5,280 feet. So to solve this problem, we can use our clues, our problem solving cubes, clues, cubes, clues, cubes, clues. And the first step is the C step. And it says to do what? Circle the numbers. So help me find some numbers. What do you see? 19. What else do you see? I see the number one. And what else do you see? 5,280. Bam. Did we find all the numbers? Yep. We're done with that step. The next step in our cubes clues is the U step. It says to underline the important words. So we can start off by underlining the unit that goes with each number. So look at that number 19. 19 what? Miles. Underline that. Bam. And look at the number one right here. One what? One mile. Look at this next number, 5,280 what? Feet. Underline that. So we are done with those keywords, those important words, but there are other important words in the problem. What do you see? Convert. That is an important word. What else do you see? The word feet. We see that word again. Okay. Not these kind of feet. Not that kind of feet. What kind of feet? The, the root. Let me go get. Let me get the other kind of foot. Bam! This is another kind of foot. It's not a human foot. It's not an animal foot. It's a ruler. It's a ruler foot. Did you know rulers have feet? Ha! Ha ha ha. That kind of feet. Not for walking, but for measuring. So one foot equals 12 inches. But one foot, oh no, 5,280 feet. 5,280 of these makes one mile. Oh my goodness. We need a lot of, a lot of rulers. That's a lot of rulers. And what else is, okay, there, we need to underline that word feet right there. And the word distance. We know distance, that is a length word. And, oh, I think we're good with all our keywords. Bam, done with that step. The next step is the B step. And the B step says to do what? Box the question. Go ahead and find the question. We can box it, highlight it, circle it. What? There's no question. Ah, but there is something there that we need to do. And what is that? We need to convert, convert the distance into feet. So we need to change the miles into feet. We are done with that step. The next step is the E step. Eliminate unnecessary information. Remember, I tell you all the time that Sometimes problems try to trick you, math problems try to trick you, life problems try to trick you, but you're so smart, smarter than every pro any problem in the world, you can think about it and work it out. Is there anything in this problem trying to trick you? Anything trying to trick you? No, nope. we're done with that step. And the last step in our cubes clues, cubes clues is the S step, and the S step says is solve and check. So, to solve the problem, we need to think about what operation we need to do. Not a doctor operation, a math operation. Hmm, are we going to add? Are we going to subtract? Are we going to multiply? Or are we going to divide? Hmm, think about it with that smart mind of yours. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Yes, there are two ways we can work that out. Let me show you. If I had one mile, okay, that is not how long one mile is because a mile is like from here to the store or from your house to the school or from your house to the store. One mile is the same thing as 5,280 feet. FT is the abbreviation of feet. We need to get how many of these? 19 of those. We need 19 of these. 
So we need to we'll figure that out. There are two ways. We can either add or we can multiply. What are we adding? We can add 5,280 how many times? 19 times. All right, I forgot to write the word add. Add that 19 times, which means you can write 5,280, bam, 5,280, bam, 5,280, bam, 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 19 times. Well, I don't have time to do all that. Maybe you have time to do that. And if that's the way that you want to work it up, hey, that's fine. That's your brain. Work it out however your brain wants you to work it out. My brain tells me, Miss mm, Alana's brain, Miss Alana's brain says to multiply because that is the more efficient, quicker way to solve the problem. So, do you want to help me multiply 5,280 times 19? All right, so the first thing we need to do is to multiply this 9. So let's do 9 times 0 is 0. Oh, make sure you have good zeros. 9 times 8. Practice your times tables if you don't know them. You can use your agenda to help you, okay? Use your agenda if you need help with your times table. 9 times 8 is 72. Write the 2 plus 7 up top. 9 times 2 is 18 plus 7, 18. 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Write the 5. Put the plus 2 up top. 9 times 5 is 45. Plus 2, 45, 46, 47. Write the 47. I'm done with that 9, but before we move on, I, look what appeared. The calculator appeared. We can use a calculator on your phone or a regular calculator. I want to check that before we move on. 5,280, just like that, times 9 is 47,250. No, 40, I didn't even say that right. 47,520, which is what we have up here. So, so far, we are on the right track. Moving on, we are done with that 9. Cross it out, I'm done. Done with you, done with you. Don't forget the placeholder. Bam, right there. And now I need to do what? Multiply this one. So to multiply that one, we do one times zero is zero. One times eight is eight. One times two is two. And one times five is five. Now, before we move on, we're gonna use my handy dandy work calculator. No, 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 not the ruler. That's not the right tool for now. 5,280 times 1. Oh, you don't even need the calculator because 5,280 right there. 5,280. Now we need to add them together. 0 plus 0 is 0. 2 plus 0 is 2. 5 plus 8. Start with 8 in your mind. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Write the 3. Plus 1 up top, 1 plus 7 is 8, plus 2 is 10, or 7 and 2 is 9, plus 1 is 10. Write the 0, plus 1 up top, 1 and 4 makes 5, and then 5 more right there is a 10, or 5 and 4 is 9, plus 1 is 10. Bam, let's check our answer, 5,280. Times 19, oh, let me show you, 5,280, bam, just like that, times 19, bam. Ah, no, ah, look what happened, no, no, that's not right. See, even the calculator messed up. Let me see, 5,280 times 19 equals, that's more like it. See? You can't always trust the calculator. Sometimes you press the wrong numbers, and then you think it's right, but it's wrong. Trust your mind. Always trust your mind. 100,320. We know the comma goes right there. And what is our unit? Our unit is not miles. It is feet right there. Not that kind of feet. These kind of feet. So to travel 19 miles, I'll need 100,320 
rulers. That's a lot of rulers. So we are done with that problem. Don't forget, subscribe to our channel, Miss Alana's Class. Like all our videos, helping you learn math. Call a friend. Hey, friend. No, not with the calculator. Call a friend with your phone. Text a friend. Even text your grandma and say, hey, grandma, subscribe to Miss Alana's Class so you can learn math too and get smart just like me. See you then.